Channel. Welcome back to the channel, whichever it is today. Welcome to welcome back to the ultimate like so rank and we're good go where I go from beginning to most recent in their fish to solve every song by song. Give my thoughts and print to a list most sure to least favorite. What you can find in the pinned comment section below. The story so far we got there in the end. Big love to Teresa for making this whole series happen, guys. We are still in the Christmas zone, as I'm calling it. Uh just a reminder that Christmas songs are the toughest to rank. Um, in these ranking series without a doubt the toughest songs to rank in the way that I really need to for someone who does not like listening to any Christmas songs before December 1st um, I don't I need to get into a mindset for it. it's very tough actually these these Christmas songs um, I know a lot of people said I've had a few people in the comments say like why are you doing them now um, and everything like that um, first off chronological order obvious um, secondly God, I mean, waiting, leaving all the Christmas songs until December, going back to them each time, it would be absolute murder. Can't be done. So as challenging as it is now. Um, also, I want to say as well, Christmas songs, and the whole reason it's tough, is that they are tied to one month. There's a lot of other songs on here which in, which could be listened to in December and any part of the month. So that's always going to give those songs an advantage anyway. Even if I was to do these ranking episodes in December, guys, it wouldn't change things too much, to be totally honest with you. So Christmas songs, I, I have to say, are always going to be at a bit, at a bit of a disadvantage for me in that way because they're so tied to a holiday and a month. Uh, but they could still be great. Um, and even though it's a song, I would say... Uh, that isn't necessarily a Christmas song in the way it sounds. It's just an amazing ballad. You look at Miracles in December, that's my top so far. And that's a Christmas song. You know what I mean? So they could still be great. But anyway, yeah, I will not be waiting till December to do, to do these Christmas songs. So I wanted to say that because, again, it's very tough to rank Christmas songs in these rankings. It's not EXO aren't the only ones I'm doing it for at the moment. Taeyon, I'm in the Christmas zone for Taeyon too. And it's... Uh, it's tough. But anyway, first snow, let's go.
It's a very good Christmas song. Very good. Because without some of the lyrics, you get, get away with it being outside of December, if that makes any sense. Very good. Like in the instrumental, there's not loads happening as far as Christmas feels, like the bells and everything. Really, not big yet. Really great vocal melodies in this. Damn! Oh, some nice synth there at the end too. Uh, right. Let me get the list up ready. It's interesting what I was saying about the whole Christmas thing a second ago with all that. Um, yeah, whatever you did, that was, I must have checked out a live performance of that on my Patreon. Or seen someone cover it? I've definitely heard that song before, is all I'm saying. I've definitely heard it before. Um, so there you go, guys. It's funny, I was saying, right, just before. But the whole thing of like Christmas songs being are almost at a disadvantage, um, sadly, because they only kind of work at their best in one month of the year. Um, that was an excellent Christmas song, actually. Like I thought the vocal melodies, especially on the chorus, was stunning. I thought the verses were great. Had an R&B vibe when EXO does R&B. I mean, R&B K-pop kings, like do you know what I mean. Um, they all sounded great. Um, nothing had changed about the song itself, and like I said without like being reminded now and again by some of the lyrics about there's Christmas you could get away with that just being like a nice R&B ballad to be totally honest with you so yeah very very impressed with that one um, and again where have I heard that before uh, right looking at my list I'm gonna start from top to bottom I don't know where it's gonna go I'm gonna start from top to bottom um, I wouldn't pray about miracles in December growl baby don't cry mama Baby. Again, it's so tough to rank Christmas songs because it's, like it's an excellent song. I wouldn't purr about my turn to cry. I wouldn't purr about out the beast. I wouldn't purr about wolf. I wouldn't purr about history. Don't go. Heart attack. Machine, I would per above uh, two moons. Uh, again, guys, it's so it's, honestly, I can't tell you how tough it is to write Christmas songs, especially when they've got Christmas lyrics and Christmas elements to them, like this does. As great as this was, it's just the fact that because, again, I know there's a Christmas song, the, the Christmas lyrics come in, it's like, ah, uh, I can't really listening to it in December is gonna be amazing, but like, I can't. Even though it's close to getting away with not with with you know listening to it at other point, points of the year, it still it still is that Christmas song and everything like that. But again, I'm I'm sounding negative about it. It's, it's a great song. It's a great song. It's a great R&B Christmas song. Um, and again, in, in December, it's gonna work awesome. Um, I must have checked that out on a Christmas stream. Maybe a live performance of that. Maybe that's why I'm remembering it. Um, but anyway, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hit that like button if you did. So that can be a great idea. If you want to see more EXO on the channel? Uh, let me know where it goes for you. Again, you may agree with how hard it is to rank Christmas songs in the comments section. And um, please subscribe because plenty of EXO on the channel already in the EXO reactions playlist. Plenty more on the way. So hope you guys have a lovely rest of your day, morning, afternoon, night, whenever you're watching this. Please take care. Much.